Hello legends and super legends. Welcome to Velo Harmony. I just got back from a ride and I decided to do this video because this is the first ride in the cold temperatures we've been having where I only had to pee once. So I did a lot of research and I found one source that comes close to explaining things the way that makes sense. I will read it to you and then I will give you my interpretation. And I will put the link in the description for those of you who want access to the article yourself. It's a site called OutsideOnline.com and this was written by a gentleman named Rick Curtis, the director of Princeton University's Outdoor Action Program. And I will read the article verbatim. He says, what you're experiencing is called cold diuresis. It's D-I-U-R-E-S-I-S. -S, a phenomenon that occurs for reasons that remains, that are not entirely clear. One theory that remains popular, though it has been contested, explains how it works like this. When your temperature starts to drop, your body will attempt to reduce heat loss by constricting your blood vessels and reducing blood flow to the surface of your skin. When that happens, your blood pressure will rise because the same volume of blood is flowing through less space in your body. Makes sense. In response, your kidneys will pull out excess fluid to reduce your blood pressure, making you have to pee. A full bladder is a place for additional heat loss, so urinating will help conserve heat. Now, it was the closest thing with all the articles and stuff that I researched that made sense because the rides where I was, I was peeing a lot, my hands were colder, my feet were not so warm, and so forth and so on. Whereas today, we started at about 37 degrees Celsius, I think it's about 3C, let me see here, almost 3C, 2.7 thereabouts. So we started at 3C, we ended up finishing the ride probably at, I think 13, about 59, it was supposed to be 58, so 14C. So we went from 3C to 14C today, unlike last week when we were doing the Rafa Festive 500, where we stayed right from like, Three, three to four C, and then it actually went down to two C. So it stayed in a tight range. Today was our normal variation where things warm up quickly. So I had to dress differently, but I doubled up my gloves, and so my hands were never cold. So when it got warmer, I took off one, I took off my liners and just put on a regular glove. My feet were covered. So as a result, I I went through the normal cycle of having to pee maybe once when we stopped at the park. So that kind of coincided with this article that I just read you and I felt like I would make this video to help those of you who are experiencing those kind of things when you go out to work out in the cold and you're peeing a lot. What it means is you didn't dress warm enough. So the days where I didn't quite get the gloves right, didn't quite get the feet right, didn't get the head and so forth right, I peed more. When everything was right, I didn't need to pee that much. Like today, didn't need to pee. I, it was nothing that was normal. We usually pee, we stop at the store and I, I may need to go. So the day was normal. So when you're out there riding, don't try to be a superhero by going in and putting in, a, you know, regular shorts and then toughening out instead of dressing for the weather. Because what that does is that will make you pee more because your body's going to do stuff to make sure it keeps you alive. It will go against your poor judgment and try to keep you alive. And that's what's going on. So you end up peeing more because of what's going on inside your body. So I found different articles that had different tangents, but this made more sense. And so it may not be the only idea or the only theory, but it made sense to me and I wanted to share that with you. The bottom line is to summarize is, if you don't dress warm enough, you're gonna pee more because your body's gonna try to compensate for the mistakes that you made. So when you're going out and it's cold, dress warm enough put on enough stuff make sure your hands are covered your feet are covered so that your body does not start making adjustments that causes your 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 fluid in your body to end up in your bladder the way you need to pee more frequently so if you're cold you're going to pee more because that's what happens to your body so i wanted to make this short video to just get that out there and i hope this will help some of you understand why you've been peeing more frequently that means some part of your outfit was not up to snuff.
okay? With that being said, do not let the weather stop you.